Oh, just can I have a cuddle? Can I have a cuddle? Yes! Oh. No one is to have access to her other than me, okay? No one. Is that him? What's all this about, anyway? Maths is for saddos and geeks. <laughs> what, like you, you mean? <laughs> Settle down, you lot. <laughs> yeah, shut it, loser. He's got his ears just right. <laughs> he looks like a hobbit. <laughs> Philbo Baggins. <laughs> I'm not a freak here, yeah? Right? You are. I can't say that. <laughs> hey, enough! Just get out now! You're right, Carla. You have no right to say that. What the hell do you think you're playing at? That is unacceptable behaviour. You want to buck yourself up. Or what? Call my mum. Everyone's jumping through hoops for you. Me, Rachel. Well, I didn't ask you to. All right? I'm not your problem anymore. No, you're someone's problem. You, me and Rachel, we're going to sort this out. But for now, you're going to go back in there and apologise to Carla. Campbell reckons she's a genius. So? So? I think there might be a nice little learner sitting there. Hey, Carla. I reckon you can make some serious dough for those. I don't like baking, I like going. What you really need is an agent. An agent? A businessman who buys and sells for another in exchange for commission. This is bang out of order. I've got no right to come here. How did you even find me? I didn't realise it was a secret. I have a message from Grace's father. The family would like to ask you for a gift. A tiny amount, really. To help build a retirement house for our mother in the village. My brother was sure that he would want to help with something that is, after all, for Grace's grandmother. A blood relative. We all miss Grace very deeply. How much? A thousand pounds. A thousand pounds? That's a lot of money! A small price to pay. So, um, how long does it take to do one of those? A couple of minutes. I could help you sell your drawings if you like. Don't want to sell them. Well, not these. Some other ones. I can put these ones on display. Show everybody how good you are. What do you think? We can split the profits 50-50. Okay. I don't have that kind of money. I can barely afford to... Look, I've just got back from Rwanda. I've not even been paid yet. I'm sure someone like you has plenty of friends who could help her out. But maybe I might be in a position at the end of the month to find something... I need this sorted today. So oh, please, give Grace a kiss from our uncle. I'm just really disappointed, Philip, because I thought we'd been through all this. Fine, we will discuss it again at home, okay? You're not my mum. Believe me, I'm not trying to be. 
OK. Go on, go on your break. And, Philip, I don't want to have any more reports from any other teachers about your behaviour, OK? OK? <sighs> Honestly, he's like that at home. He's, he's, he's moody and he, he's sulky. God knows... I do understand why, Eddie, but I honestly don't think there's anything more I can do. There's nothing you can do. Just show him you be there for him. He's just testing us, seeing how far he can push us. Hmm. What, before we walk away? Oh, the poor lad. I mean, his mum's abandoned him, his dad doesn't want to know, he's not returned any of my calls. No wonder he feels stuck with me. He's lucky to have you. Just got to show him that we're not going anywhere. Why don't we go out tonight? The, the three of us. Might do us all a bit of good. Well, we could go bowling. I mean, I know Philip loves bowling. Right, well, I'll book a lane and you can have Philip on your side because you'll need all the help you can get. <laughs> Eddie. Thank you. I really do appreciate it. I just think Philip needs a, a male influence in his life right now and... Well, <laughs> I could do with the support too, so... I'm happy to help. of a work in the art room at lunchtime. Uh, look, I don't think that that's what you... Why not? I mean, you said yourself she's a genius. We should be showing her off. Uh, Carla, what do you think about this? Uh, are you OK with it? Yeah, uh, Michaela says that we can... Yes, eh? She really wants to do it. All right, um, fine. I'll come and check on you at lunchtime. Come on, Carla. Uh, check with Miss Mason first. Yeah. For two now, aren't you? You sound like an old woman. Anyway, not allowed to eat in here. Yeah, yeah. Look, I was thinking maybe we could ask Tom, see if we could have Mika's room for the baby. Turn it into a proper little nursery, you know? Yeah. And we could paint it yellow. That way, if it's a boy or a girl, then... Don't take me. Can we do this some other time? Look, my dad said if we need any help with a pram, he can help me. Don't take... Can... I'm trying to study. Chloe, you're always studying. Yeah, well, do you want me to stay in that clapped-out old van forever? No, I just want to talk about us and the baby. Yeah, well, we can do it another time. Because if I don't get this essay in, I'm for it. Right. Well, I'll tell you what. You sort yourself out. Don't worry about anything else. Caesar. Yeah. So, um, what's it about? Read it for yourself and see. I'm not finished yet. But, well, it's about this bloke. Caesar. And, uh, well, he gets killed by his best mate, Brutus. It's a bit rough, isn't it? It's a bit like Blair and Brown, but with murders. <laughs> it's, um, it's all about a power struggle, politics. Bunch of men thinking they know what's best for everyone else. The language is great. Why is that? Well, everyone thinks Brutus is this great hero, and then Mark Anthony comes along and blows him out of the water. He makes this speech that shows Brutus for what he really is a thug. The really brilliant thing is the way he does it. Do you know what, Rose? I've, uh, I I've not heard anyone get quite so worked up about Shakespeare since I was at uni. Well, he's a good writer, isn't he? Yeah. You should join your kids in class, give Marley a run for his money. Go away. Stuck in a mouldy classroom, listen to some bore drone on. Thank you. School and me, Tom, we never got on. And I tried those classes. Dull as hell. Yeah, uh, they were literacy classes. I mean, basic stuff, you're way beyond that. The English. English is different. It's uh, about discussion, debate, opinion. God knows, you've got plenty of those. See you later. Miss Campbell said that we should ask Miss Mason first. Yeah, I already have. When? 